As Vistar Credit Union members have been struggling to get information on their accounts for a week now, we've learned the CEO has been on vacation. The credit union says everyone's money and transactions are secure, but customers are complaining of inconvenience and sometimes inconsistent information. News for Jack's reporter Ann Maxwell spoke one-on-one -on -one today with Vistar's chief member experience officer. What exactly is wrong with Vistar's new online and mobile banking platform? You know, we had a planned conversion last weekend to move to a new online and mobile banking experience. And the goal was to provide an enhanced member experience for our members. Unfortunately, when it came live, we had some unexpected issues. Are you confident online banking will be working by, let's say, next week? I can't give you a time frame, but I can tell you that we are working around the clock to bring the system up just as quickly as possible, and we've made significant progress. By June, maybe? Would it be ready? Uh, I am confident that the system will be ready soon for our members. One News for Jack's insider wrote on our website, cannot get through to the chat, telephones have long wait times, and no one has even mentioned that it's costing nearly $5 a gallon to go to a branch just to get a current balance. I mean, people are frustrated. Yeah, and I apologize, and we take responsibility. I, on behalf of our entire senior leadership team, accept responsibility for the issues and, and inconvenience that our members are facing during this time, but we are doing everything possible to staff up our contact center and our branches to provide that service to members. We have back office team members across the company that have, that have stepped out and gone into branches and are taking calls to try and take member calls. That said, I do understand the frustration with some longer wait times. Where is the CEO? The CEO was on a planned trip in a remote location with his family already when these issues occurred. As soon as they occurred, he, along with our entire Vistar senior leadership team, were in constant communication and have been, and he made plans and began transiting back to Jacksonville and is on his way back right now. So he's been on vacation for a week? Has he been working on this since last Friday? Our CEO was already on the trip when this started, and he's been in constant communication. And as we know in today's world, with remote working, he's been incredibly involved and engaged this entire time. Why didn't he fly back immediately to help? He was in a remote location and logistics were difficult and he put in plans immediately and is already in transit back. Where was he? I'm not able to disclose that. When will he be back? He's on his way back now. Back in July, software company Nimbus, which has offices in this building according to its website because of its collaboration with Vistar, they announced Vistar had chosen Nimbus as its online and mobile banking solution partner following a 20 million investment by Vistar back in April and Nimbus's newly formed credit union service organization. And their website shows you're on the board of Nimbus's board of directors. Why did Vistar choose Nimbus and have they had experience successfully implementing a banking system like this before? Yeah, Vistar selected Nimbus after thorough due diligence and evaluating their technology that they bring to the marketplace. They have over 25 other clients, including one that's a $50 billion bank and has successfully implemented solutions like this before, but every implementa implementation is unique. Vistar tells us Nimbus isn't the only vendor working on this project. Uh, we also reached out to Nimbus and a spokesperson tells us this is a complex multi-vendor project and they're continuing to assess the situation with Vistar and other partners. Uh, they say they understand the burden this is placing on Vistar members and their priority is getting that online banking working again for them as soon as possible. Live in Jacksonville and Maxwell, Channel 4, the local station. And you're right, so many people are so frustrated. You also found out how many people are working on these issues. Yeah, Mary, uh, that executive I spoke with said uh, 40 to 50 people are working around the clock on this platform. He also said they've got 900 people working customer service. And as we've reported earlier this week, they have about 800,000 members. So a lot of people out there needing help. And Maxwell, thanks so much. And we also asked Vistar about some specific issues that we've heard from some of you at home about transactions not working properly. The credit union said, again, its core systems are accurate. It's encouraging anyone with specific issues to reach out to them or visit a branch. You can also get your balance by using Magic Touch phone banking. You can find that number and instructions on our website, newsforjax.com. And you can find Ann's full interview with Vistar on our website, newsforjax.com.